Hey guys, it's uh, Rob Wilson. As you can tell, the market's still open, but I thought it might be useful to um, run through today's price action against the, um, the market preview and analysis that I delivered to the TFL website uh, this morning at London Open. Now, in that um, in that update, I identified 132.20 as a good, you know, resistance area which had the ability to turn price. And I also mentioned 131.80 below price, but only if we had some, um, you know, if price had actually tested the top of that range before we got back down there. And I just wanted to, um, you know, to go through those levels and give you some idea about how effective they were in today's thin market. Well, you know, when I go through, um, you know, back over price, I see that um, 132.20 was tapped um, effectively six times. Here, once, twice, three, four, five, and sorry, I've missed one. Here's six. So six times 132.20 was tapped and reverse price. Now, once that had happened, if we look at 131.80, 131.80 is essentially tapped three times, one, two, three, during the market's main hours. Well, what does this all mean? Well, essentially, it means that had you just placed consecutive limit orders at 132.20, you'd have made 15 pips on the first tap, 17 pips on the second, about um, 13 pips on the third, 24 pips on the fourth, 37 pips on the fifth, and just 18 pips on the sixth. That's and we, you can see we just had one more tap and we don't know where this is going to go. If we look to the downside at 131.80, we can see that was tapped three times. On that first, on the first counter move, you'd have made 30 pips. On the second counter move, you'd have made 26. And on the third counter move, you'd have made 40. The total of that total pip count is 219 pips. The most heat you would have taken on any of those trades is right here, and you'd have taken about 15.816 pips heat on one trade, okay? And when I look at all of them in the round, 50% of those trades, you would essentially have taken no heat whatsoever. I, you would never have been running in the red for you know, anything more than one or two pips. So, 219 pips were available. Um, and on a couple of occasions, you took 15 pips heat, but never any more. 50% of the time, you took no heat whatsoever. Now, I doubt if any system traders or breakout traders could have delivered that sort of result in this sort of market. And that is the power of support and resistance trading. If you're not listening to the market previews or on all my market updates, you really ought to be, particularly in the current market conditions. If any of you are interested in having a look at bullet trading or support and resistance trading that I deliver in a monthly class for a small membership, then please have a look at the Bullet Trader uh, homepage. There's some testimonials up there now, or have a word with Ro either Rob Booker or myself. I hope that's of use. And, um, well, what can I say? You know, <laughs> good luck with your trading, I guess. Cheers.